Alright, I'm fucking here. Guys! Th th look, this is exactly why I use, like, extended 30-minute cuts of Sonic soundtracks, okay? Because then you guys don't go, It looped! He's supposed to be here, dude. He, the music stopped for fucking a half a second, dude. He's here, dude. Why ain't he talking? Because I was getting fucking coffee. Alright, because I was brewing myself a delicious cup of coffee. I lived. All right. I lived. Unfortunately. Uh, Katie, you have to be more excited than that. Remember, if I died, your income would uh, stop via my uh, payments. Uh, it would It would end with me. My death means you're unemployed. Really, it should be your utmost priority that I survive. <laughs> Currently, right now, my survival should be pretty up there. So glad he's alive to press the pay Katie button. Yeah. 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 He gave you two whole days off. Be great. True, dude. True. Man, I was off the grid the last two days, guys. Holy shit. Yeah. I got back from my... Dude, actually, I was way more zonked after the whole deal yesterday than I was last year. I don't know what. I had a headache going into the hospital, like a mild one coming on, and I was like, you know, this is probably just stress. It'll be fine once I'm done. Uh, I woke up from the procedure in like the little bed and they were like, hi, here's all this information you're not going to retain. Uh, normally I would have retained it, but like I, my mouth wasn't making the same sentences that my brain was like, here's what to say next. My mouth was like, I'll say it, but I'm going to say one or two words wrong. And it just did. <laughs> so uh, I was a little bit more out of it than last year. Um, I continued to stumble around until about the time I got out of the hospital. Uh, I was like, kind of like, yeah, and then I got behind the wheel of my car. <laughs> and, and then I got behind the wheel of my car without any supervision, and I kind of just tore down the road. <laughs> no, I got picked up by my family. Uh, but, um... Yeah, they don't, they don't let you have that procedure without someone picking you up, Chad. Don't, don't worry. Um, but, uh, yeah, then I, like, ate a bunch of food because I was freaking hungry. I went to sleep, and when uh, and then I woke up two hours later with a horrific headache uh, that was so bad that I couldn't uh, lay down. So instead of getting four hours of sleep, I got two, and then I stayed up for an hour to, like, get rid of my headache, and then I went back to sleep afterwards I'm just better today though I didn't wake up with a headache or anything yeah guys all I'm gonna say is uh, the doctors once again did that thing they did last year where they were like so here's a photo of us posing in front of a bunch of the images of your like colon uh, we have we have some like we took some here where we were giving like thumbs up here's somewhere like we're all making funny faces Except last year, honestly, guys, honestly, the interior looked a lot better. Uh, this year looked a lot. Dude, I was having less fun looking at the pictures this time. <laughs> <laughs> this this year's pictures make it look like I like the budget's running out. You know what I mean? The uh, the budget's running out this year. They, they, the place just opened up last year. This year. Uh, this year had a lot more notes. <laughs> ah, new season is doing so well. Yeah, guys. Hey, well, here's the thing, Chad. Last year when I had it done, I probably was in the tail end of whatever bad situation I was dealing with that year, because it comes and goes usually on like a yearly cycle. 
I got that colonoscopy really late compared to when I was really struggling. Uh, this year I got it pretty much around the same time as my stomach was bothering me, so, uh... Hopefully, uh, once results are back, I'll have a proper diagnosis and can start doing something about it. So I'm honestly kind of glad that it showed something, because last year I just really had my time wasted for three months and then nothing happened. So I'll take, I'll take pictures that make it look real bad in there. Honestly. Did they find any circus clowns? They, there was no clowns. There was, there was no clowns. It's, uh, just, just, a, just a lot of, just a lot of intestine in there, guys. Just, it's, it's just, it's just a normal old ailing, uh, zone down there, you know? Miles and, yeah, miles and miles. No nails, I don't need those. No clowns, no. No, it's it's all fine, guys. It's all fine. That explains why he is so unfunny. I assure you, even if there was a clown somewhere in there, it would not be affecting the way I speak and form sentences. So, uh, it, I would still be... As unfunny as I always was, I would just have a clown in there. There would be no difference. Clownlet take. Oh, believe me, it would affect your speech tomato, says Colonoscopete. Well, Colonoscopete, I guess if anyone would know, it would be you, our resident weirdo. I suppose if anyone would know this specific thing, it would be you. <clears throat> yep. But yeah, we got ourselves a uh, we got ourselves a, a lovely stream today, playing a game I've been putting off streaming for a little bit. I'm quite excited though to check it out, and then uh, tomorrow will be another normal stream. And then Thursday will be Hell Divers 2 with Benji G. Martin Sam. Unless we get it a day early. I don't know if the, sometimes game devs send out their codes for their games like the day before with a no alert or heads up. So, that, I mean, we might play it tomorrow if uh, that, pl that plays out. Otherwise, uh, playing it on Thursday. Have you played the first one? No, but at this point, um, I'm quite happy to not. Frankly, guys, whether it's really good or not, here's what Helldivers 2 is for me. It is warm up these guys for EDF. All right. <laughs> it is warm these guys up for March 14th. Okay. Warm them up for March 14th. EDF release when? Apparently March. I don't know. The, the, it's weird because when I, like, I've searched it a couple of times and some places are like, it's coming out on March 14th on PS4 and PS5. Uh, but then when I search it on other places, they're like, it's spring at some point. So maybe it'll be March 14th. That's what some places are saying. One, one can only dream. I saw Payday 3 player numbers. It's in the 200s. Can I unsubscribe from Payday 3 updates? Can, do you, can I, is there like a button I can press on your like uh, chat box to unsubscribe from messages? And updates? Usually you can do that, so I'm just wondering if maybe I can do that. This is a depressing newsletter. I don't want to know that anymore. I didn't sign up for this newsletter, and I don't want it again. Thank you.
Just put him in the spam folder. Hmm. 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 Perhaps. But yeah. Uh, since some people are still coming in asking how I'm feeling. I'm feeling all right. I've got like, look, I've got like a perpetual, <clears throat> like constant minor headache all the time. I think it's just remnant stress from the whole situation. Uh, the whole last week, honestly, has been a fucking mess for me. Uh, so I'm, I'm kind of like now catching up and like hopefully stuff will start to get better. So, uh. Yeah, just, I'm trucking along, I'm fine. You should probably unsubscribe from the Tekken and Destiny updates while you're at it. The fact that I'm, uh, that Destiny is one thing. The fact that I'm getting Tekken updates genuinely doesn't make any sense. It genuinely doesn't make any sense. It's like me getting League updates. Like, I, what the fuck are you talking about? You're in the wrong chat, you meant to go to Sam's. Go to Sam's. Like, I don't, I don't, I definitely didn't sign up for that. Damn. You just subscribed to, to, <laughs> to Liao updates. Uh oh, guys. Someone just subscribed me to not just League updates, but a scam phishing site version of League. <laughs> It's gonna steal my vin it's gonna steal my base game account. But I won't unsubscribe because it adds it's got some really compelling articles, despite the fact that it is a phishing site. It's got some dick whoever's writing those fucking articles really puts a lot of work into them. Yeah. Can we subscribe to me any fun, something fun like Animal Facts? I'd like to unsubscribe from everything. Don't ever send me updates. Chat, really the only thing, like I, I like subscribing to the idea of just really bad surprises. Like I don't want to be subscribed to anything. I just want to kind of open up my bank account one day and find out all my money is gone because um, my bank was trying to alert me to fraud for the last like two months and I un and I opted out of the subscription that actually allows me to know when I'm getting robbed. All right, I want it to be that far. I basically don't want anyone to tell me anything until um ba until I'm in the ground and, and dead. Keep me in the dark. <laughs> uh, subscribe to a life of confusion and just kind of going, what the heck's going on? And having no one respond to you. White noise. You know? The blinders. <laughs> Can I unsub from tomato? You already are. Unfortunately, this is a subscription only service, so we're going to have to, uh, we're going to have to ban you. Sorry. We're going to have to get rid of you now. Sorry. Damn. Damn. But yeah, I, ho I hope I, I hope everyone else in exchange for me enduring a great week of turmoil. I hope all of you in exchange had wonderful weeks where nothing bad happened. Perhaps I suffered so you could all live your lives as happy as can be. You're welcome. Perhaps I suffered on behalf of all of you. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. So call me a hero. You can too. Matter of fact, I would... 
I would suggest you do that. Plus 1k followers. Yeah. Yeah. Tomato Mike Guy, did you hear Megamind 2 is coming out? I saw the trailer for that and it looks like it was made with about 1 50th of the budget of the original film. Uh, and I actually, it's not, it's, it's rare that I look at something, clock it for about 15 seconds and then say, this is a cognito hazard that will harm my perception of the entire franchise. And then I close it. <laughs> that was what, literally that was one of them. I looked at it and I was like, I'm going to close this so I can just consider Megamind as a single movie again. And that was it. That was it. I did that really fast. I'm not going to tarnish the memory. Yeah, I don't want to. They didn't even need a second movie, dude. Megamind only on Peacock is wild. Literally. All right. Show of hands. Who has a Peacock account with a subscription? Who has a subscription to Peacock? Me, sadly. Me, I pay premium. Katie, are you their number one consumer? Why are you all capsing about that like you're excited and happy? <laughs> I, I love Psych. Holy shit, it's my favorite show. Yeah, but you don't love Peacock. You love a show that they have taken hostage like every other streaming service does. That doesn't mean you have to say you love Peacock. It's only on Peacock. Dot, 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 dot. Well, it's not only on Peacock. <laughs> well, it's not. Well, you know, it's not only on Peacock. <laughs> now, I'm not going to say where else it is because that would be problematic of me as a streamer. But uh, I'm sure you can find it somewhere else. Look, here's the thing. I have two subscriptions. Uh, oh, three. I tragically have Netflix, which I cancel uh, whenever I so fucking feel like it. Got my Amazon Prime. Uh, with all of its free trials that I cancel the moment after I'm done watching the thing on the free trial. You guys know what I fucking mean, dude. They have a million free trials. Cancel them as I go. Uh, and I have... Uh, Actually, it's just those two. Well, yeah, it's just those two. I actually, I guess when it comes to like shows and stuff, I have a subscription to Dropout. Because I watch like some of the stuff on there because they're fun. But that's about it. You should give BritBox a try. I'm going to pass. I don't know what that is. You said a name to me and you expected me to give it a try. You didn't even try to sell it on me. You just like told me the thing. Basically like walking up to me and saying, you should give Squingus a go. And I'm like, what the fuck did you get the, f get away from me. And I push you into like a puddle of mud for getting in my face about it. I don't know what that means. Taskmaster is also just free on you. Chat, stop talk. Listen, everyone. <laughs> get, stop talking about. I don't understand what you're saying. I demand you to stop talking about things I don't understand. Matter of fact, I order it. Bungish popped off. Actually, I do understand that. It's true. They did. Let's talk psych. Nah, dude. Nah, dude. Let's not. <laughs> Let's not. Have you watched it? 
watched a couple episodes. I just don't want to talk about it. I, which is which I'm well within my rights to do. Guys, you're are, like at now it's like a fucking fight. Like there's people that are like Psych is better than Monk, and I'm gonna be honest. I have never given a shit about either one of those two things you're saying, to be honest. And the problem is now my chat is like you guys are getting all upset about something. There can be peace. I will be the one who who brings the peace by simply saying. All of your taste is trash. All of the shows you watch are worthless. The only thing that we can all agree on is that we should probably be subscribing to more streaming services so that we can have access to more garbage. And I, for one, am quite happy that that is something we have been offered in this modern age. Is this a sponsored stream? Yes, for all streaming services. <laughs> I mean, they all contacted me at the same time to do a sponsorship, and I told them I could do it in a bundle, and they all looked at each other and nodded and said, sure, whatever. So I'm doing a big bundle. All I'm supposed to be here to do today is sell you on the idea of giving anyone money concurrently every month. With the special offer code POGTOMATOFEB50. Yes, thank you. The streamer is working for big streaming. Scandalous and shocking. <laughs> to find that out, guys. You, you know, I think we could all agree it was devastating when I found out my streamer worked for the big streaming company. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I thought he was on my side. He changed. Oh, God. Guys, still got these fucking uh, Gatorades here that I got to get through. I'm not going to waste them. Holy shit. I'm not going to waste them, guys. And you know what, honestly? What color? Lemon lime was the only thing I was allowed to drink. I thought that I thought that I would hate going back to it for another year. Uh it's not as bad as it could have been. I'll tell you what actually got me through it though, chat. Apple juice. Apple juice and freaking broth this year. Holy shit. Holy shit. Get me some apple juice and some broth. I tell you what, the only reason I didn't down a gallon of broth was because it would have made me explode. Like, that would have been it for me. The sodium in it would have killed me. But, uh, I fought for my life out there. I really did, guys. I did whatever it took. That's actually what they serve in retirement homes. That's badass, dude. Honestly, it's not sounding so bad out there in retirement anymore, guys. Installed the handlebars next to his toilet. Guys, no, there's actually though, I did have like an old person discovering technology has advanced moment on the toilet on Sunday and it was kind of crazy it actually brought a tear to my eye so I was like sitting there on the toilet annihilating it <laughs> and and I had my steam deck I was like oh fuck like a dragon infinite wealth is steam deck verified but I forgot to download it on my steam deck and I was like well it's gonna take fucking 30 hours to download on this thing and then when I clicked the button it was like you know you can just stream it from your PC to this thing right from like across the house I was like, what? Huh? And they're like, yeah, you can just stream it to the handheld. I was like, uh? Uh? And then I did that. 
You didn't know that? Guys, here's the thing. I am not a person that uses my Steam Deck in my house because I have a PC and like my chair. <laughs> that I sit at my PC with. So why would I be sitting anywhere else and be like, I want to do the same thing I could do at my like desk, but like 20 feet away from my desk. That doesn't make any sense to me. My Steam Deck is for traveling and like just being out, right? So like, it, it, it boggled my mind. It's finally its purpose in my home beyond traveling uh, was discovered, which was, it is specifically for when I have to shit violently for possibly hours, which is great actually. And like, I'm glad that I figured that out now. Uh, it will forever carry the scent. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> you nasty fuck. My guy. <laughs> what kind of fucking shits are you shitting, dude? <laughs> what are you talking about? Dude, if your shits are spreading a... Rancid scent to everything in your fucking bathroom when you do you need to go to a fucking doctor, okay? I'll tell you what <laughs> Miracle posting <laughs> Actual toxic gas That guy shitting out scarlet rot. Guys. <laughs> Guys. Look. You have to stop. You need to stop. <laughs> What's a day cloud kill? Guys. Listen. I don't. I, let's all just have that person in our thoughts and prayers. Okay. Let's all have that. Let's have that guy in our thoughts and prayers. And also pray that. Uh, you know, maybe stuff will get better and don't come near me. <laughs> I'll be able to smell you before I see you. So don't even try coming near me. Ugh. A horrible smell. The terrible odor. Yeah, I'm actually like hoping that I can beat infinite wealth in the next like dip, like couple days. Guys, as much as I love my RPGs, especially my Yakuza ones, I am not a 100%. Uh, I'm not a 100% gamer when it comes to Yakuza games. I'll do like the side missions and stuff. And like the side quests until my characters are like, the world is ending. And if we don't run to that next spot on the map right now, 15 people will be shot to death. And then my guy's like looking to his left and there's like a funny crab dancing on the sidewalk and there's a side quest to do that. And I'm kind of, most of the time I'm like, I can't hang out with that crab anymore. And I'm finally reaching that point. So I'm figuring I'm going to be done with the game soon. That'll be nice. He's so disloyal. Guys, look. I did almost every side quest in the original Like a Dragon. And if you asked me to recollect any of them, I would say the only ones I can remember are ones that have also come back up and been relevant in the second game. I just do not remember them. Uh, which means they were useless to me and didn't matter to the end, like, memory of that game.
diaper mafia. I know there are diapers in Yakuza. I do not remember diaper mafia, but you may be correct. Are you telling me you haven't got every Sujimon? SMH, bro, SMH. Guys, I've gotten many Sujimon. I just, man, I just want to also play other games. I love this game. I've really liked the plot so far, but I am going to need to move on at some point. You can now sign up for Blue Sky without an invite. Unsubscribe from newsletter. All right, I'm just going to keep doing that. From now on. <laughs> Unsubscribe from newsletter again. Dude, I don't use social media anymore. <laughs> I don't go on fucking Twitter. I, I, what the hell? Dude, literally no time. Rat facts at tomato, okay? Rat's teeth, yellow with time because they're high. I just unsubscribe. Unsubscribe from newsletter. What the fuck is wrong with you? I didn't sign up for any of these. I did not sign up! <laughs> kind of fucked up you just abandoned riot tracks like that. Kind of fucked, streamer. Rat facts, he's coming for you. Huh? Nah. I'm, I'm talking about someone else. Wait, is this vanilla Brigador or... What do you mean? There's only one version of Brigador <laughs> on Steam. It's Up Armored Edition. It's like a remake or like a re-release. Like more content. There's like mods, but none of them are on like a decent repository. So I, I passed on that. Unless there's like some Omega Super Bundle mod. But uh, it's been, it's, there's no like decent distribution place for them. And now do not count discords, okay? I do not count Discord. You used Discord for Dark and Darker. No, I didn't. Guys, I have to tell you something. I did not install the torrent for Dark and Darker. <laughs> No, yeah, I didn't do that. I kind of drew the line at, uh, at at dev teams asking me to seed their freaking torrent so they could distribute their game better while they were in legal action with another company. <laughs> I kind of drew the line at that. <laughs> that felt like a step too far for me. Dude, I actually saw that new one. 
uh, that new one, Dungeon Derivative Name Number Two. <laughs> Completely indecipherable game from the first one game number two dungeon born. Yeah, really good uh, Really good names for these anyways, um Dude honestly Wait, it isn't the same game dude if you fucking put those two games in front of me I would actually I would squint and not be able to tell, but I mean, like, after I watched Benji play it for a bit, and it actually looks better. <laughs> I don't want to be mean. Wait, no. Yes, I can. Uh, it looks better. It, it looks more functional. Um, so far. And I'll tell you what. Dude, I clocked one thing in that game that immediately made me go, this would be the one I would play if I was going to keep on playing. Uh, and it was just the fact that the stash is character. Like, it spans all of your characters. It's account-wide. Uh, so it, you can actually, like, fucking, like, make builds without playing a class. <laughs> like, just, like, better quality of life. It's got that Nexon money. Is it? Is it Shadow? Is it? Is this one of those Shadow-funded games by Nexon, like Dave the Diver? Wait, 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 wait. Is this the Shadow-funded one? It's fucking tragic that the only way Nexon can make a decent game is if it's full of spite and deception. <laughs> that's true. It is so... That's so fucking... That's, that's fucking funny. <laughs> the only way they can make anything decent is by shadow funding games. Uh, that's fun. Next in Trojan horsing as an in indie. Well, I know that was the case for Dave the Diver, unless someone wants to correct me. I'm pretty sure I got that story right. Pretty sure that's how I remember it going down, is that they, like, basically set up a dev team with funding and, like, pumped an indie game with Nexon money. Uh, which was super not rad, uh, kind of fucking bullshit, even though Dave the Diver is a good game. Uh, it's still, you know, it's not really, in a way it's not fair to everyone that was making like indie games at the same time to be compared to Dave the Diver, which had insane funding behind it. But, um, yeah. Is, is that Dungeonborn game next on, or was that just a meme? Because I didn't actually look into it. No. It's just memes. Okay, good. Because I would... <laughs> it would be... I mean, here's the thing. It would make sense, wouldn't it? If Nexon was like, Hi, Dark and Darker stole a bunch of our shit and then flipped this and made a better version. All of a sudden, like... that. Then suddenly I'd be like squinting my eyes a little bit more. But, I mean, yeah, no, fuck Nexon. <laughs> Pal World could have been a Nexon game. Are we done talking about... Is Pal World done so? Guys, do people still talk about that one? It's got another week or two before it, before it f fucking shrivels, right? It's got, it's got at least another week. You have subscribed to the Pal World newsletter. Unsubscribe. Yeah, unsubscribe from it. <laughs> you have unsubscribed to Netflix? Honestly, cool and good. Thank God. You have subscribed to Daily Donald Duck Facts. Donald Duck is okay, but we're gonna unsubscribe. Thanks though.
Damn. We are we are gonna get in game soon because obviously, uh, I just have nothing to fucking say to any of you. You know what I mean? Like, let's go. Like, come on, let's be real, guys. Let's be real. All right, <laughs> let's be real, guys. Come on. You you lived again. I know. I'm back. I'm back. I'm stronger than ever. Uh, fair and real I guys I just um I would like to I'd like to game today <laughs> all right I spent the last like three days straight like staring through the fucking like wall behind my desk because I was so fucking stressed out I couldn't do anything I just want to fucking game you guys know what I mean <clears throat> I just want to I want to game now Arnar Bjorn, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. Thank you very much. Thank you. So you hate apple juice now. Honestly, chat, I kind of wish I had a glass of apple juice in front of me right now. I actually could annihilate a glass of apple juice right now, but I don't have it. It's in the fridge outside. You know, I made a big mistake though, chat. When you're preemptively purchasing stuff for a, um, for a lot of drinking, a lot of liquid consumption, uh, you don't really calculate how much you're actually going to use. So what I bought for apple juice was like that gigantic one with the fucking handle on the top. I bought the keg. I bought like the fucking keg of apple juice and I drank about one fifth of it. I've got the I've got the catering jug. Uh and like my family doesn't no one drinks apple juice like on the regular like for kicks. So I've got this I've got way too much apple juice now and I don't know how I'm going to get rid of it because frankly as much as I loved the apple juice in the moment I'm not going to fucking be like downing a ton more apple juice and I'll also tell you what same thing can be said for the, like, about gallon of chicken broth I have in my fridge. I'm going to be honest, guys. <laughs> That'll probably get used by my family at some point to make delicious, like, I don't know, chicken noodle soup or something, maybe. Or, like, a stew. I ain't using any more of it. Like, my, my its purpose was served. And I've got too much of it now. I've got way, I've got, like, an extra couple... I've got like another dozen bottles of Gatorade that I'm never going to use. Uh, I, I really, look, but you never know. I might've been fighting for my life yesterday and I would've needed a lot of Gatorade to survive. I didn't, much like the year before, but over preparation, uh, I over prepare a lot. Apple chicken juice broth, <laughs> just terrible. Tomato exclusively buys all his drinks in bulk. Listen. As a man who loves... As a, as a God-fearing American citizen with a Costco, I buy things wholesale. Okay? That means sometimes I end up with a little too much apple juice. Sometimes, I end up with a little bit too much juice. Yeah, I got a pallet of uh, apple juice kegs outside my garage. I had it delivered by forklift. I wasn't bluffing when I said wholesale. I bought the whole, pl the whole pallet. I didn't know how much how much I was going to suffer. And now in true American fashion, I will be spilling all of it into the nearest storm drain. Can I have some? No, it's all going to be disposed of in as wasteful a way as possible.
the great apple juice spill of 2024. Damn. Damn. All right, chat, so here's how we're gonna do this game. All right, there is a campaign, it's a Brigador. However, the more compelling thing to play is freelance mode, cause you can like unlock things and like make your own builds and like explore the game mechanics a lot more interestingly, in my opinion. But we will, we will do the campaign to the point of like learning the controls and things like that. Then we're gonna switch to freelance. All right, with the little, with the scraps of money I'll make from doing the campaign. All right, that's, that's the plan. And we're gonna start in like two minutes. I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then we're getting in. We're right back. I bet he's chugging the juice right now. Guys, I actually could have fucking done that. Why didn't I think about that? God damn, I could have gotten juice. I could have gotten juice, man. Why would you? What do you mean, why would I? Why, why not? Why would you? If I'm thirsty, I could get myself some apple juice. I'm confused why there's a question. It doesn't make any sense that I'm being treated like this. Where's the skip intro button? Oh, you found it. Hey guys, all right, I'm back from the bathroom. Uh, let's get in game. And let's get in that video game. Rewind? There is no rewind. All right, the past is always the past. There's no moving, there's no moving backwards. All right, we're gonna start, again, we're gonna start with the campaign to get through the basic tutorial stuff, and then we're gonna switch to freelance mode, and we're gonna play with like uh, stuff we buy from acquisitions. Cause um, there's a lot of unlocks in this game. And it's a lot more open-ended. And we will, once we do freelance, uh, much to uh, the mod's dismay, begin Gambe. Why, God? Gotta give you something to do. Gotta give you something to do. Gotta give you something to do. Campaign. Uh, wake on foreign shores. Contract removal of one target personnel, opposition, light loyalist. Caution, your legal status as a citizen of Solo Nobre will be permanently revoked upon completion of your first contract. If you have any questions, purchase a copy of the terms and conditions in FAQ. The Solo Nobre concern hereafter SNC has intel on Ramiro Castello, a military commander in civilian clothing attempting to escape the present situation. SNC has isolated him on the highway using district gate controls, taking applications from any active limited time contractor. Uh, hereafter Brigador. Okay. Uh, well, uh, let's check my loadout. Looks like we're using a Toro 
Pyre's Toro is armed with an Abbott 105 millimeter cannon and a Maydor 12.7 millimeter machine gun. Smoke projector for defense. Loadout is tough, versatile, and effective at any range. Good all around damage. We're gonna need all that going into this one. All right, everyone, keep your heads down. We're going in. All right, we're, we brought exactly what we need for this mission. Effective at all ranges. We're going to be fine. Lock and load. 621 local time. Oh. Great leader is dead. Solo Nobre must fall. Okay. Solo Nobre's got to go, guys. All right. CEO says so. Excuse me? Wait. One hundred dollars. Guys! Everyone here is worth fifty bucks! <laughs> wait, 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 where the fuck you think you're going? Yeah, you ain't going nowhere! What the hell? Hang on. Dude, I just made nine thousand dollars off of that. This shit's easy. All right, let's go. Target to accept contract. I'm not even part of the company yet. I did that on the house. All right, well, uh, where the hell is uh, that marked target at? Hang on, let me just clear out some more of these doofuses. I mean, I don't know what they're doing in an active military zone, anyways. Is that my guy? That's my guy. Hang on, let me just walk through all these cars and um, yeah, it's him. Welcome, we got him. Man, this job's gonna be easy. How much I get paid for that? $132,000. Sorry, $2.7 million. And that, ladies and gentlemen, that, ladies and gentlemen, made everything I just did okay. Uh, those casualties are actually worth $27,000. Uh, these are earnings. Um, the company wants uh, everyone evicted. Uh, I don't know who those people were, but they're, they're not here anymore. I'm gonna send them out of here. Uh, collateral damage. Uh, captain's dead. Uh, vehicle multiplier. We made a lot of money off of that. Many years ago, the paramilitary group Novo Exercito do Povo seized power over Solo Nobre, the capital city of Solo Novo Solo, our colony. Peaceful negotiations with the leader of the NEP, the tyrant known as Great Leader, have failed. After Great Leader closed the spaceports, the citizens of Solo Nobre have been forced to endure years of regressive economic policies and isolationism. So long as his menacing array of orbital guns installed throughout Solo Nobre point up to space, there can be no outside assistance from the SNC or other benefactors. It is accurate to consider your participation in the present opportunity a heroic sacrifice. We're hero, Chad. Guys. We're heroes. We're the good guy. Remember that. Uh, it is accurate to consider your participation in the present opportunity a heroic sacrifice, a tangible contribution to the restoration of rightful planetary self-governance. With your help, the SNC will restore Solo Nobre to prosperity. Welcome, Brigador. Cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, uh... We've got a tutorial mission here. Beginner's Falafel. Clotilde Alto, your reputation precedes you. The SNC counts many admirers of your work in its employ. The situation on the ground in Solo Nobre will take a little explaining. However, follow your in-mission instructions uh, if you would be so kind. We apologize for starting you off with no ammunition until you leave the base. Some of our maintenance techs are nervous around you. By all means, please familiarize yourself with the Zolig in a lightly defended subdivision in Letterar District of Solo Nobre. Okay. This thing looks... All right, my mech looks really stupid. Uh, what is that, a target uh, on my front? What is that, bullseye target? Okay. Uh, deploy. Let's just deploy. Was to mouse to aim. I've set up tank controls. This game has automatically set to not tank controls. I like it with actual tank controls so I can actually, like, feel like I have some 
control over the movement. So I'm playing with 10 controls. These squares indicate help information. Okay. Uh, wait, hang on. $100. Wait. Another $50. It's really easy cashing out on this game. Uh, what's this? Space bar to stomp. R to pick up ammo. Okay. Easy cake. No problem there. Left and right mouse buttons to fire weapons. What is this? A lovely suburb? I get paid per house on this shit, guys. That's $7,200. Uh, we're going to clear out that tank, too. Uh, a playground. Wait, was there a playground back there? Where's that playground at? Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get rid of that. I don't want anyone to think this is a place children should still be scampering around. This is a war zone, okay? There, we got all of the monsters. All the tanks are gone. Finally, this place can start to heal now. Without the pres the presence of those tyrants. All right. Stop, guys. Listen, I'll donate this to charity. Jesus, chill out. I don't know why you're acting so upset about all this. I'll donate some of it. Fucking hell. Hell. I made two million dollars. I'll donate 5% to like everyone's favorite charity. Okay, Jesus. All right, piece of cake. Contract removal of opposition over 70%. Well done, Miss Alto. Would you mind providing another such display of prowess for your next contract? <laughs> you really destroyed that suburb, something fierce. Uh, it, uh, there is a request from upper management to see a video feed of Clotilde Alto in action. Your task is to sweep the neighboring industrial zone of loyalist tanks. Good hunting. Okay, I think once we finish A1 through 4, we're done with as much of the tutorial as I feel like I need to do. Uh, aim at targets using your vehicle's firing arc. Okay. So, I can actually see the line intersect with things. Alright, cool. There is a line to intersect. The blue firing arc is for your primary weapon, left mouse. Hang on, those guys have guns. Guys, it was self-defense. <laughs> guys. It was self-defense. They came right at me. They were sprinting at me. They were lunging at me. Hang on. That guy was giving me attitude. Hang on. One of them cussed. Red firing arc for your secondary weapon. Okay, copy that. Just clear clear out all that trash. Get this all out of the way. Your weapons hit whatever your firing arcs are intersecting with. Okay. Copy that. Uh, pay attention to cover height when aiming. Okay, so if I'm looking at like the distance, I can aim over this. I can shoot over this cover. Okay. Uh, let me just stomp through all this mess, and uh, we'll move on over here. Hang on. Why are those two tanks kissing? All right, I got them, guys. Guys, don't worry. Those tanks won't hurt anyone anymore. All right, I got that one, too, guys. Hater. Space bar to stomp. Yeah, we already know these things. Hang on. What is this place? What kind of military operation is this that I'm beating up right now? Farm and feed. What the hell were they doing here? Sick bastards. We will take this place back from the terrorists. Do you understand? Uh, hold E to reorient legs towards mouse cursor. Okay, copy that. 
We will. Oh, he almost got murdered right there. Did you guys see that? All right, we got him, guys. Farm and feed people. That's what I'm thinking might have been happening, guys. You missed a little? Hang on. Hang on one sec. Hang on. Let me smile. See, that's how you know that peace can be restored. Okay. That's how you know peace can be restored to this place. And besides, I'm out of ammo, guys. All right, I can't hurt anyone anymore. Stomp mouse hole through building to hit tank from behind. Okay, well, that's a little bit more than a mouse hole, but we'll go ahead and roll with it. Hey guys, chill. Okay, got him. The tank seemed to acknowledge that. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and move back around this way and get him from this side, I guess. Hey. Got him. Any survivors? Got him. Oh, yeah. No ammo. Hang on. Hang on, guys. Oh, shit! We're taking fire! Mm. Wow. Well, stomping works really well. I'm just gonna walk over this and we're gonna keep moving. Why are we getting paid money every time we kill a civilian? Legally, everyone in here is illegally squatting. Uh, this is this whole planet is is uh, corporate property. Anyone that's anyone that's on this planet right now is actually doing it illegally. Uh, they're squatting. They were asked to leave and they didn't, so now we're taking it back. Or that's what I that's what I'm assuming from how much I'm being paid for this. Uh, which is you know a cool a cool two million dollars. We'll donate two percent to like a wildlife reserve or something. Okay. Clotilde, your aptitude for violence in a mech rivals your skill with a blade up close. The SNC will shortly archive these contracts for posterity. Please continue your removal of loyalist forces into the next sector of Letrar. Okay. We've already made $6.7 million off of this, guys. We're doing great. We only should have like a couple more we have to do before we're done with the tutorial. Control the toggle-centered camera. I've already been doing that. Uh, what have we here? Crouching greatly reduces damage taken. Didn't actually know about that one. Okay, so that makes me like a stationary turret. Noted. While crouching, use your mouse to look down the road and fire at the tanks. Okay. Oh, that's far. Yeah, that's far away. Hang on. Not bad. Not bad. Let's roll. Took them down clean, guys. Took them down clean. Lock and load. What's all this here? Extend your camera forward again. Try flanking this next group of enemies. Oh, those ones? That are all facing towards me here? Okay. I'll go around them. And I will step on every single one of these random criminals on my way over. That one's that one killed himself. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Watch this. Really important stuff here. Watch this. That they're gonna climb underneath the feet and kill themselves. Look at that guy. That one right there. Watch this. Okay, they seem to be pretty scared actually. Hang on a minute. Wait. He thought about it. He turned around. Hang on. Press H. Oh shit, you made me honk my heart, you asshole! Oh! Oh, that orphanage just blew the fuck up! I was avoiding stopping on that because it was a fucking orphanage! 
Guys, you killed that fucking orphanage. Ah! That those were those buildings were evil. We got them. You know, honestly, mission accomplished. Who is that? There's one dude shooting at me. He's doing like zero damage. We got him, guys. We got him. Let's get the hell out of here. Hang on. I've got like 6,000. I've got 1,600 ammo still. So let me just... Just mow the lawn. <laughs> you guys mind if I just mow the lawn really quick? We go. Let's go. All right. That guy thinks he's safe beyond the exit. And I'm gonna stand right here. Fuck, he's camping. That. Get the fuck over here. Come here. I need another fifty dollars. Wait. A little bit closer. Oh. Uh, we got him. All right, we got him, guys. Let's go. We got him, guys. That terrorist isn't going anywhere. Two million more dollars in the back. We'll donate 1% to some charity that no one's heard of. Uh, marvelous. I hope we're not boring you, Clotilde. It's really been a pleasure. This contract should be the last of us deigning to provide any instruction to you while you do such beautiful work. This is L. Wrightson, by the way. I'll be keeping an eye out for your next contract acceptance, okay? And we'll have a cool, like, 10 million to use on the uh, freelancer mode after this. Perfect. What is this? Hold and release middle mouse button to smoke screen the tanks, then shoot or stomp them. Okay. Ah, uh, really neat. How does that work for me? Oh, they straight up can't shoot out of it. Okay. I've got, guys, I've got grenades. Top left icon smoke will count down when your smoke is ready to fire again. Copy that. All specials are cooldown only. Quickly swing your aim while deploying smoke to cover wider arc, then attack. Ah, uh, like this. Piece of cake. Okay. Neato. All projectiles inherit your momentum. Use smoke while moving forward to launch it farther. Wait. Hang on, I'm still recharging it. Ah, what's happening to me? Did that guy just use like a fucking like microwave beam on me? I don't care, man. He's dead now. Matter of fact, they're all dead. We're out of here. Mission complete. You have cancer now. Well, it's okay. I can probably... Guys. I've got what? Like $20 million? I can probably fix that, guys. I got $10 million. Alright. Uh, listen, guys. The, uh, the campaign is cool and all, but what's more cool is... Freelance... Norman Osberger. <laughs> so, the way freelance mode works is that you can spend your money uh, that you earn in the missions to buy vehicles, primary weapons, secondary weapons for specific vehicles, and like special operation missions and stuff. And it kind of becomes like a sort of unlockable as time goes on, like roguelike kind of thing. There's a lot of stuff in this. And, s and all I'm saying is, guys, what we want to do is we want to save up for Mother's Love, the... Uh, Horrific, terrifying death tank with a human head. 
uh, for 50 million American dollars. Um, that's what we're going for. Skibbity tank. <laughs> Come on, you guys really can't fucking ruin it for me that fast. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. But listen, to make it more fun, uh, because we earned all that money doing campaign levels for free, is I'm actually going to reset my progress again, and we're going to start freelance from scratch with just Norman and zero American dollars. We're rolling with just Norman today. Just one Norman. Just one broke Norman. A relatively recent immigrant to Novo Solo, Norman fled more civilized sectors in the wake of some terrestrial scandal or other. Nothing worth mentioning, but seems to be consumed by it still. Our sources paint him as a hard luck case and subpar mechanic. Certainly no Corvid would tolerate his shoddy work. Unlike most hapless NEP drivers, however, he knows exactly what his abilities are and Something more important, he has nothing to lose. His death wish may be perfect for our purposes, provided we offer the right insurance package to benefit his survivors. MPCC. Guys, so every one of these pilots has a different start difficulty, max difficulty, increase per level, bonus they receive for money when they finish a level, and payout multipliers. So the, high, the higher level your guy, the more money you're gonna make when you finish the level, but the more uh, difficulty it's gonna have as well. The only vehicle uh, that poor Norman here starts with is a Toro or a Prowler or a Buckler, uh, which is an anti-grav tank. We're gonna stick with guys a good old-fashioned classic Prowler tank. NEP Brass likes the heavy stuff, but once in a while the design bureau can slip past a real versatile design like the Prowler. Trick is to give it some kind of bullshit designation like Rapid Assault AFV and then stuff as much power plant in while they're not looking. A nice low profile operates well in urban environments. The Prowler balances speed and armaments well. Open up the engine on a straightaway and the speed is there. Perfect for flanking, even if the boost is only for short bursts. We only have smoke. So the only weapon we start with, uh, with the Prowler here is a broiler, which is a laser shotgun. Okay. And a secondary, uh, looks like, uh... Armor piercing machine gun. Now, mods, we're gonna start doing gambas now. Cause stuff is gonna start getting fucked up as time goes on. These are gonna be does he it's basically we're gonna pay out the gamba on payout. Okay, so when the mission is paid out, it's a does he win on payout? Like does the scoreboard show up on payout? For these. We only have one special, and it's obviously the smoke projector. And we only have really two options. We can either do random district, or we can do orientation. Orientation sounds like coward shit. Norman doesn't need orientation. So we will be doing random district. This little guy isn't even bringing in the AC-20. Well, while we're letting the Gamba go through, I can look at my other options for vehicles. The Buckler starts with also a broiler. Oh, just two broilers. Well, I'm, we're not using the Buckler. The Buckler... Listen, one thing I know for sure, guys. Anti-grav ain't the future. Anti-grav is just some fancy pants bullshit. Okay, it, the, the real technology is on two treads on the ground. Okay, tanks. All right. Spacers can go to hell. We do not like legs and we do not like 
levitation either. We just like treads. Big heavy machinery. It's time. Random district. We're allowed to leave early. We're going to try to go as far as we can. I'm not a coward. Four districts. Deploy. Okay. Uh, we're at like some train tracks. I've got an actual tank this time. If I hold space bar, I accelerate the tank, which lets me do things like ram into vehicles and buildings and just kind of ruin them like this, which is fun for me. All right, all the objectives are painted on the map corner right now. Which is also one this way. Anyway, what's this over here? Ah, ammo. So let me check my two weapons. That is a laser shotgun. And it looks like I can reach this from here. That guy really did run up to the building to check in on it. <laughs> that, there was some dude living in this shack. Got out of the shack. It was like, what the fuck is that going towards the ammo house? And scampered over <laughs> to it to check in on it. What the? And now he's dead. Damn. All right, come on, guys. We'll go through the freaking woods. Whoa. What the fuck is that? It's investigating the destruction. That thing's got a shield or something! We got it. I don't know what it was, but we got it. Had some kind of shield. I'm getting paid. Chat, I'm actually getting paid per deforestation, too. Look at that. Just made a thousand bucks off of that. We gotta be careful on our ammo use, though. We need to be smart about it. I think we head up top through the woods. Through these... Really uncomfortably through the trees is uh, what we're gonna do. We're gonna go due north. To this, uh... Jesus, the fucking... The... The... The foliage here is a little thick. I'm just gonna work through this. Just gonna push through it. This is why we brought a tank. Any of those fancy pants... Leg tanks wouldn't have been able to do this. Wait, they gave me ammo. Thank you. They actually gave me free ammo. Oh shit. There's like cruisers. Okay, this is this this is suddenly a lot more than I uh than I was anticipating for some reason because I was doing all like the linear tutorials before and now I'm fighting like actual things hunting me down at points. Uh, all right, next up on our, my objectives is something up there. We're gonna keep moving. We'll just keep rolling. There's some dude taking a walk in the woods. We got him. He was probably going to tell on me, but we got him. Come on. Uh, that is a orbital missile launcher. We're gonna get rid of that. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. The, uh... Fucking energy shotgun is so bad. I actually think it's awful. Um... It, let's... I feel like it barely defeats, a, like, a... Scrap metal house. Ah, I just ran over the coffee shop. Just push through the fucking trees! The fucking the woods the, the tree line is just too thick. Okay, well, hey, at least when we get the drop on someone, we we do we do kill them first. The tree line is too thick. Why? There's so much greenery in this place. It's almost impossible to navigate. Hang on. All right, they gave me some ammo. I'll put him down clean for that. All right. Oh shit. Oh sh oh shit. We're getting they're converging upon me, Chad. There's a whole collection of various tanks. We got them. I do have to remember this is a difficulty one level. Most of these guys are probably that, those are actual like tower turrets. I'm stuck against the trees. Hang on, I'm gonna. Hang on, I'm just gonna. No! 
We got him. If he dies in difficulty one, I'm not gonna fucking die in difficulty one. I'm just getting used to the tank. All right, I'm getting used to the controls, all right? Norman's gotta get some warm-ups in. Hit! Boom! What is that, exit? I don't wanna leave. Uh, yet. Where the hell am I going to next? There's something in the middle here between the... It, it, it. Oh, shit. Okay, so those tanks can absolutely see me. <laughs> I got cover right now, but, uh... What the fuck is this? What are these? Three captains are targets. And, uh... I see three mechs here. I'm gonna assume they might be... Hang on, I'm gonna poke a hole right through this wall. I'm too short! Ah! Ow! Oh! Oh! Okay. Those things are monsters, and the turrets beat the shit out of me. My health is bad. I'm gonna need to go around a different way. I don't think going through there is gonna be good. That wasn't an enemy, that was just someone's car. I'm gonna barrel through this wall. I'm gonna try this from like here. I got an idea. First, I'm gonna get rid of this tower. Now, the captains will probably converge on this location. And when they do, I'm gonna have line of sight on them. We got them. Piece of cake. Captains are down. We pulled them into the woods and we took them down. Yeah, I might stop gambling. Why? Why? Because I'm still get. I forgot about the turrets! Just get into the trees! We don't even have to kill those guys. I better go. Why? Hang on, I've got a, I've got an ammo station to pick up some ammo from over here. This will be great for me. This guy stay off the main roads, guys. Wait, are these ammo stations? Oh shit! Oh, got him. I'll be taking that. That ammo will do me some good. Oh! How much damage? Chat, I'm gonna be honest. My laser cannon, quite literally, barely does damage to things. The the laser shotgun is maybe the most pitiful piece of shit I've ever had. He doesn't know. What what do I not know? Oh shit. Oh shit! Bastard thought he was gonna get their jump on me. He doesn't know about it? What's it? Oh, that's an ammo star. Hang on. Wait, wait, I was just joking. Oh, I don't think they're gonna give me ammo now because I... Chat, that blew me up. <laughs> Chat, that... Chat, that blew... That blew up Norman bad. Guys. That hurt Norman really... Oh, shit! Oh, it's dead. Never mind, we got him. I think that blue is shield. They'll keep me alive for some time. Let's get the hell out of here. Paycheck incoming? Not on your life. I'm going for the exit. Oh, the turrets! Chill, chill, chill. Get back in the trees. <laughs> How many times am I going to forget about those? Being a perma-doubter always pays off. Is this your car, perma-doubter? Oh, sorry. Is it this one? Oops. That guy bet on the wrong team. Take me home. 
Uh, here's how we're going to do this. Stop. Don't. Pay out. Because I didn't realize I could leave early that easily. So hold for one second. I'm going to explain something. If I leave early, I feel like that needs to technically be a loss because I didn't complete the mission. If I leave early and I cash out, I think that needs to be a loss because I didn't actually beat the level. Scammed? Sorry, dude. You're never going to get your prestige. I'm actually just doing it to fuck you. Sorry, dude. I'm just doing it to own you. So paying out a loss now? Yes. If it's one where I leave without actually completing the mission, because this is a four sector mission. I'm only, I've only done one. I took a free like airdrop exit or like, I think that that, that counts as a loss. Ah, massive payout for the for the fucking doubters, dude. Look, it's important rules to arrive at. Some people will be devastated. They may never survive. But look, don't blame me. Blame Norman Osberger, guys. <laughs> guys, blame blame Norman Osberger. All right, you know what I mean? Blame Norman Osberger. Don't play. Don't blame the gamer. Blame Norman. You can hate Norman all you want. Guys, I think I'm going to immediately invest in uh, switching to the Toro. And uh, we are going to be investing in new weaponry. What the hell is this? Wait, it's restricted and redacted. Oh, it doesn't tell me what these things are unless I buy them. Railgun 25 millimeter sh Okay, uh, guys, I'm gonna invest in a railgun. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, so I'm gonna requ I'm gonna requisition that. I bought a Zeus railgun. That should be good for me. Long range, flat arc, large AOE, immobilizing stun, single shot, deafening report, thunderous impact. By far the most popular Lorenz force weapon to be e to ever see field deployment. Each round is cased with a superconductor coil that is charged at the time of firing, creating an intense localized magnetic field that confines the round to a micrometer wide path in the barrel. The slugs exit at supersonic speeds and can pass through the entire buildings with ease. Targets in the vicinity will also be hit by an intense shock wave, requiring sensor systems to briefly recalibrate. This is very humane and legal. Nothing, there's nothing about this according to corporate that could be frowned upon. All right, we are allowed to shoot this thing. Be it in crowded urban combat or suburbs, this is, it's very, it's, guys, it's a pinpoint precision device used to dispatch terrorists, okay? The aptly named Zeus has a black mark in acquisition since its popularity with the War Council has led to unfavorable comparisons and countless pet projects getting canned before reaching prototyping. And guys, don't worry. Does it look like Norman would misuse the Zeus in a combat scenario? Does Norman look like the kind of guy who would shoot the Zeus in an, in an, it's fine. We're gonna bring the Toro with the Zeus mounted, and uh, yeah, we're gonna bring this uh, machine gun as a uh, backup smoke projector still, and we are going to purchase a actual mission now that isn't orientation, which actually technically we haven't done orientation. Uh, we're gonna spend $500,000 getting first strike. Freelance operations may only be completed at the Brigadier's discretion. Only one objective type is necessary to open the exit gates, destroy orbital guns, remove marked targets, remove 70% of enemies, or any combination of the above. I ain't a pushy. We are going now. Engage. Here we are. Looks like some kind of cargo station. 
Now I'm actually using a mech with legs again, which means I have my stomp move. Okay, let's give that let's give that railgun a test. Guys, if the railgun is uh Let's see, let's test it on an actual objective. Yeah, the captains are up north. We're gonna go to Am I getting shot at? Oh, there's a tank right there. Okay, so that's my AR. Whoa! Okay, the tanks are pissed off about something. We're gonna say, we're, all right, so I use right click for just my machine gun right now, and that's what we're gonna stick with. I'm not gonna use any other crap until I see something worth firing at. What the fuck is that? Fucking kill it. Whoa, chill! Jesus, this fucking thing! <laughs> okay, guys, the railgun does some damage. Jesus! Cool it! Everyone just chill, okay? Chill out! Guys, it's actually, guys, the thing is, it's actually more allowed to shoot one of these in a crowded area because, um, you know, machine guns, when you get hit by one of those, sometimes you live and you go, eh, and that's, that's bad. But like this rail gun, you get hit by that thing, you're missed. You know, you're pink missed. And that's actually more allowed by corporate right now. I gotta save the rest of my ammo. I've already spent a third of it just shooting it kind of like it, it, at people in a real- Oh, actually, I'm getting refunds uh, when I pick up- Wow, there's a lot of people here. Excuse me. Let's just go this way. We'll take a look around the area. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> that was a priceless landmark. I just blasted with a railgun while trying to aim at a dude in front of it. <laughs> entire block of homes is gone. Uh, could have casually held right click and just dealt with it with the uh, machine guns. But instead I shot over it and hang on. Fuck! This thing's hard to aim. Damn. Guys, it's really hard to aim this fucking thing. I swear. Got him. Got him. All right, that's the garrison mostly destroyed on this level. I'm gonna pick up some ammo from the ammo store. They'll sell to me. Please? They're not? Piece of shit. Railgunned? If you won't sell to me, then die. Wrong type of ammo. Oh! Look, guys, this place spells H. Jesus, this thing's fucking fun. Oh, shit! Got him. I'm not seeing anything in the distance. I'd like to get the rest of the depots. Most of the garrison is dead. Oh, this. Oh, here we fucking go. Check this out. Boom. Gone. This guy doesn't even know what the fuck just happened. Oh, shit. Got it. Boom. Gone. Blast that guy with the turrets. It's over. Okay. Relax. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, perfect. Pick up this overshield. Reload some of my railgun. There should be another fucking thing over here. What kind of ammo is that thing? People are saying that I need a special, like, special... Okay, I see. So, these things sell specific ammo types. I have to I have to go to ones that are actually the right ammo type for me. So, that one's trash. So, we're just gonna blow it up from here. Next time, stock what I need and you won't die. We're moving. Come on, guys. Oh, there's green. We need green. Whoever's like in the tower, this is just watching this asshole walk through an entire building to restock his fucking ammo. Thank you. Okay, bye. Uh, 
Ah, oh, fuck. I missed. Hang on. All right, we got him. We got him, guys. Hang on, someone heard that? All right, we got him. I'm gonna miss this rail gun when I'm out of ammo for it. I really am. Come on, guys. We got more uh, structures and comm stations and depots to destroy and reload our ammo with. What is this? I just, I didn't even mean to shoot at that time. I'm guessing this is a substation. All right, these are all four of the substations I need. Blast them with the machine gun. The turret will do good work here against this trash. Very good. The substation is gone. There's another depot somewhere to the north that we did not dispatch. We'll go up and deal with that. People are kind of just really freaking out about it. And honestly, I think they're overreacting. I, I, I think most of the people here are overreacting. I don't know. I feel like they should have seen this coming. This is not my problem. Uh, the last mission felt slightly harder. Well, I was also using a tank with a trash main gun. Ooh, that guy, they sell red ammo, guys, look. I'm gonna just cut myself a hole through all this. Excuse me. Reload. Okay, thank you. Fucking terrorists. Kill them all, that's what I say. Kill them all. What is this? All right, let's get the hell out of here. What is this? Some kind of machine made by the terrorists? Destroy it. Guys. I'm getting paid $200 per grass I like mow the lawn of. Hang on, look at this. I can mow the lawn and make a lot of money here actually while I'm at it. The company pays me for lawn mowing. So we're gonna mow this. And then we'll get back to it. This is so like Norman. Are we the baddies? No, guys, we're not the baddies. If I was the baddies, uh, you'd, you'd know it. It'd be very obvious. <laughs> Bully type game. What do you mean? I've not done anything wrong, okay? I can assure you of, get this the fuck out of my way. I can assure you of one thing, all right? Everything in this game so far has freaking deserved what I, exactly what I've, get, get out of my way. As, uh, uh, they deserved what I've given them. Get the fuck out of the way. <laughs> Guys, this is all company property. I work for the company. What is this? Oh, it's a comms tower. I'm out of real gun ammo. Guys, that's bad for me. Dude, I just essentially, I just like basically keyed that whole train, but ripped it in half while I was keying it. I wasn't even walking into it. I was walking by it and just cutting it in half the whole way. Whatever, man. God, get out of These people are gumming up the feet. Like they're actually slowing my walk down. Out of the way. You know, it says I've still got like a something to destroy. And there's a structure over here I gotta fuck up. $50 a head? Yeah, it's barely even worth my time. All right, we'll just get this with the gun. The normal old machine gun. I feel like that was a bit of an overreaction, but uh, mission accomplished a hundred percent. Let's get the hell out of here. I feel like that was a little bit of an overreaction. Don't know why they behave like that. Now, when is a uh, when is a level gonna push me to use my special ability? You know, that's what I'm wondering. I haven't had to use my smoke screen for anything, and it's definitely not because I forgot about it. All right, guys. Remember, we don't get payout till we finish the. Alejandra 
spaceport zone, uh, which, oh, we don't replenish our ammo or health. Okay, deploy. Listen, there's only 38 enemies on this map compared to the last one, which had half of that number. It's fine. I'll just make my ammo from killing them. We'll just have to be more careful with sweeping the area. This place is clear. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna stomp that shit. Go ahead and just stomp it all out. Get rid of the substations that way. And by the time someone shows up to check what's wrong... Okay, I'll already be gone. We're gonna climb into the... We're gonna take the side road. We're gonna sneak in. We'll come in through here. We're gonna start hitting these freaking depots immediately. Immediately. One of these has to be my ammo type, but it's not this one. What's that? Back up, back up, back up. Crouch! Fire! We got him! All right, they're not gonna beat me that easily. Who the hell's that? Some guy with a gun. Oh my God, that thing's moving fast. Crouch! Fire! We'll just hold this line. Oh, the captains are coming. I can see them on the map. Ah! Oh, shit. Chill, 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 chill. Chill. Just get her. What's that? Oh, is that an alarm? Is that, is that a silent hill alarm? We are not going to die like this, guys. And I'll tell you exactly why. Smoke. One captain down, blasting the next one. Just lighting up the whole road. Reload. Finally a challenge. Oh, is that most of the garrison? Pathetic. Kill them all. Look at this lovely neighborhood. Look at this. People used to live in a place like this. Then they all became squatters. Great leader is a fuck. True, guys. I don't subscribe to that shit. I'm more of a uh, corporate brain guy. I, I got that CEO grind set. You guys understand. Norman's on the way up. Norman, Norman's on the way up. Oh, perfect. Blue ammo. That's useless to me. Get rid of it. Kill that guy. Die freak. Uh, we're moving on. Railgun. Get rid of it the old fashioned way. We have 166 rounds left. I gotta be careful. We wanna use stomps. Like that. Freaking. Freaking buildings everywhere. Dangled keys in front of him so he didn't commit war crimes. I'm not committing any war crimes because this isn't a war. Okay, this is an eviction. Okay, I'm not, I, nothing I'm doing is war crimes because there's no war going on. A smoke bomb. The captain is looking for me. He's trying to find me. He survived a railgun blast. But the uh, second follow-up shot did him in. Oh, shit. <laughs> that guy, that one lone guy with that, like, grenade launcher was completely atomized. Uh, it was by accident. I didn't mean to. But he's gone now. Everything just happened there I did mean to do, though. Just clear this whole place out. Okay, guys. My Zeus railgun is not instantly killing enemies anymore, so... Jesus, relax. So I'm not really sure what the point of it was. That's why I spent the last of the ammo. 
Come on. We have uh, one more rail gun to deal with. We'll get rid of that. And then we'll go on over to this ammo store. Let me just stab through these walls. And go to the ammo store and reload. And then use the... And reload and then use the ammo to destroy the ammo store. Oh, shit. That guy sucked. Oh, shit. Well, this place has been mostly cleaned up now. I would say... Mission accomplished. As soon as I clean up these four last enemies. Wait, 40 out of 53? Chat, has the garrison increased in size? I'm not leaving until I finished my last structure. Oh, fuck. Chill. There is some scary shit coming over here. Just gonna smoke it. Ow! We got him, guys. Whatever was over there, it's dead now. Yeah, the alarm went off. Guys, I'm gonna be honest, it feels like the alarm should be constantly going off on account of the fact that I'm a mech uh, about the height of like, if we use this as a comparison, uh, a, yeah, four-story house, three-story house. Um, feel like constantly an alarm should be going off saying, look out, there's a big fucking problem. Norman is here. You know, like, this shouldn't be... This shouldn't be rocket science. Pretty small mech. <laughs> yeah, but a lot of heart, you know what I mean? Where's that last depot? There's one more depot. I plan on destroying it before I fucking leave. I'll tell you that right now. Who are these idiots? Fuck off. Wow. Oh, you can hold the button down. You just do that forever? Wow, this game is really easy. Okay, bye. What if I said no? Okay, I can't destroy my own exit. Good to know. Let's get the hell out of here. Doubters. Doubters. Huge L. Pilot multiplier. Zero. <laughs> Zero dollars because of Norman on that. But we made a cool 3.6 million dollars. Which means, chat, I think first thing we're going to do is invest in a new character. Uh, evacuate from the Norman situation. We hate Norman. Um, and we're going to upgrade to... Let's get, let's get a two million. Let's get, let's get, guys, let's get Arturo. Wow. How about Ripley Snell? How about Ripley Snell? Ripley Snell. We're gonna we're gonna unlock Ripley Snell. Okay. Bassist for twelve seven. Oh, they're an they're an artist. They're an artist. And we're gonna also unlock. Hmm. I could unlock a new mech. Treehouse? What is, hang on. Is that a car? Is that a pile of cars? Wait a minute, this is not the energy I was expecting. Normally, if there is a normal for a siege engine made out of old jalopies, you'd expect the cars to be stripped out entirely for something like this. Instead, Corvette engineers keep all the horns and headlights and link them up to the main cockpit controls. When one of these comes rolling in, blaring and blazing like the, angel on, the angels on Judgment Day, the treehouse goes from silly to terrifying in seconds flat. Fortunately, the thing itself does not have that kind of acceleration. Uh, keep your distance and don't let the bastard surprise you. Okay. Uh, I have a Kraken chain gun. I have two chain guns <laughs> mounted on my lovely car. Uh, still working with the smoke projector. Hang on, I want to go back to acquisitions because you can also buy lore. Can I buy intel? 
Oh, I already have some intel. Civilian. The yellow raincoat in Solo Nobre is considered as sacred as waving a white flag or a red cross. <laughs> Erase that. We don't look at that. All right, we don't need lore. More like $50 payout. Yeah, I'll tell you what, we can resell that fucking yellow raincoat for $50. Okay, on eBay. 2024 war criminal. Guys. Quiet. It's not about that. Hang on. I'm opening it. Ah, this bottle. Ah. Uh. Okay, we're bringing, we're bringing the death vehicle. We're gonna be making more money. Our modifier, we start at difficulty two now, max difficulty of five. Norman was stuck at difficulty one the whole time. So this is immediately worse than last time. We have no extra money, so we're gonna do, we're gonna do orientation, because it's the same as first strike, except two separate zones. Uh, we're gonna do orientation this time. Deploy. No rail guns. This fucking thing is a goddamn mess. Jesus Christ. Hang on, was it? <laughs> Hang on, I gotta set this to a better binding. Uh, my horn is now mouse four. Oh wait, what else is mouse four? Something else is mouse four. Toggle blocked it. Fuck off. I do not need that. Beep beep! Beep 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 beep, wake up! Hello? Is this a, what is this a, where the hell am I? Wait. Oh shit. Uh, am I in a graveyard? Oh shit. No. Oh, these guys are. Guys, I think everyone on the map heard me. They're not doing a very good job fighting me. <laughs> Grandma, no! My family mausoleum! It's too quiet. It's just too fucking quiet. Everyone wake up! <laughs> ah! Ah! Run! Run, it's after you! I like this tank. This one's got a lot of heart, guys. <laughs> the entire town militia is tearing out of their garages to try to fucking kill me. And I'll tell you what, they're not doing a great job. Alert. 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 Danger. Danger. Oh my god, I forgot I have the fucking... I have the... Guys? Hang on. I don't. I need to stop shooting both at the same time because I don't have a boatload of ammo. I just realized now I have the... I can hold spacebar to do the careen through things button. This tank has everything. What is that, gas station? Well, it is fun. It is a fun little vehicle, this thing. This silly little gun. <laughs> Reloading. Reloading. Oops. We got there. We got two more depots, so I'm sure I can find the one that's actually for my ammo type while I'm out.
idiot. One, two, three, four. That's all the substations down. Still looking around for that there, uh... Oh, hang on. Oh! Can I peek over this? Oh, it doesn't matter. We got there. In the end. What's this idiot doing? Alright, we still got decent ammo. There's a depot to the south. We'll swing by there. I'm gonna try to be respectful of people's uh, ears here in this neighborhood. I'm gonna try to be... I'm gonna try to stay calm. I don't want to scare anyone anymore. War's already scary enough. Oh, that's fun. I can actually shoot over this giant fucking wall because of how tall my tank is. <laughs> Dude! I just shoot over walls. I'm too tall. But you said this wasn't a war. Uh. You must have misheard me through all the honking. Yeah, no, this ain't a war. It's not a war. Run! Run! <laughs> Just running over. Hang on. I fucking hate that building. Okay, where the hell is my green depot for ammo? That's red. Oh, damn it. It's gotta be right there. It's gotta be that one right there. It's gotta be green. I'm gonna get this last railgun station quick. Not bad. Oh, shit. That guy was supposed to be an elite captain. I killed him in one shot. I only have three shots left, but I'm pretty sure that's it. There's just one more depot to kill and like three more random enemies scampering around somewhere. Why am I trying to follow the roads? I'm a tank. Here we go. Here we go. Reloading. Thank you. Thank you. Let's roll, guys. Come on. Bastard was trying to run. Simple as that. Simple as that. We are on our way to the Estrella Verde spaceport. Let's try to do this clean. You missed three, though? Let them live. They weren't my main objectives. They weren't my main objectives. What do I care if three of them get out alive? What do I care? Come on, we have work to do. Look at all these people. Oh shit. This gun just slaps hard, dude. I just really like this gun. Oh shit. Sometimes I'm a little too tall though. That's my only that's my only complaint. Sometimes my dude's a little tall. 
Get rid of that rail gun. See, this is the only place in the entire planet that these terrorists hang on, that these terrorists got to hang on, that these ter hang on. Hang on. That these terrorists got right. We're gonna turn this whole place into a fucking parking lot when I hang on. Hang on. Hang on. That these terrorists got right. We're gonna turn this whole place into a fucking parking lot as far as the eye can see. And I'll tell you what, this is a good start because I can barely see any farther than right there. Even from the top of my tower of vehicles. What the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> Turns around car turret. What the? Well. Back to scaring people. Back to being really scary. All right, come on, guys. Let's do this clean. Glad there's these nice roads. My car! Bro! Excuse me. Trash. I don't need red ammo. I do need ammo, though. Guys, I'm gonna be reduced to being silly in a second. You guys aren't gonna like what reduced to being silly means, but I'm not gonna have much of a choice. Who's this? Ah! Oh! I can always ram them. Oh shit! Oh, thanks. Guys, they paid me an ammo. <laughs> We're fine. I'm still in it. Hmm. Oh. All right. <laughs> Attention, citizens. Come outside. Come out. Come outside. Come outside. Don't stop honking the horn. Squatters out now. Oh, fuck you. For fuck's sake, he's back. Some people get the memo. Oh, there they go. Guys, obviously, those are actually folks of the uprising dressing up in their yellow freaking like trench coats so they can get the drop on me all right they're not good people they're bad people look at that guy jaywalk All he had to do was run perpendicular of me, but he ran away from me. Like, I'm testing them. See, anyone could get out of the way. They're not, dude. That's on them. How, chat, you know, I have a question. How did the alarm not go off? How have I not been snitched on? Well, that's me out of ammo. Guess I'll have to do this a different way. <laughs> One more of those and we are done. One more of those and we are finished. Killed electricity at the start. What do you mean? What, 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 why does that matter? Do substation, did the like ammo stations need electricity? Didn't know gun, didn't know bullets ran on batteries. Hang on. Dude, I'm just like running into these things. Can't raise the alarm without power. Oh. 
Oh, neato. Well, back on my old shit. There's only one person still alive on this map. Attention. Just come out. Come on. Come on. Just come out. Listen, everyone in this county is going to be hearing this till you come out. I think that's the worst thing that can happen when a really loud noise is like annoying you for hours and then it stops for just long enough that you think it's done. And it's back. Ah, <sighs> every time. Come on, guys. We gotta run this. We gotta run these things over and hope we don't blow up doing it. <clears throat> now, ammo stations do explode. I just, I feel like I can get green ammo from this one up here. I never went up to it. I'd like both of them gone. Oh. Yeah, perfect. Thank you. You've done me a great service. One last thing to kill. I'm gonna keep honking though, cause there's still a survivor somewhere, guys. There's one enemy left and I'd like them dead. So uh, I'm gonna keep honking. I'm not doing it to be annoying, I'm just doing it to be thorough. You guys understand. I'm starting a job at 6 a.m. and it takes me two hours to drive there. Can you stop? Dude, I've got good news for you. I'm pretty sure work is canceled. On account of a giant tank of four stories of stacked up SUVs has driven through it. So I think, I don't think you have to go to work today. We're going to skip the last guy. He, he's gone. 4.2 million US dollars. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Ripley is going to work for now. So is every Corvid thing like... Like ramshackle trash? Cause I kind of like that. All the, so we got loyalists, which are like nice, okay, normal tech stuff. We got Corvid stuff or Corvid stuff, which is uh, all cars and crap. And then we got spacers, which are just, I don't even know what the fuck this is. Do we get like one of each of these things to see what like uh, each of these tank versions, hang on, a grav. Wait, what the fuck is an anti-grav fucking Corvid thing gonna be like? Is this a car? It's four million dollars. That looks like a tiny car. No chat, that's the front, I think. I think that's the front. I think it's a I think it's like a car. This is the back. It's like a <laughs> You know what? The amount of effort spent styling these A grabs is almost tragic given how easily they're chewed up, but that's assuming you can hit them. Whatever genius is styling these machines must not know their engines because not even a tomahawk can keep up in a straight race. No two are the same, but they all look something out of an old silent movie. No clue where the builders saw one, though. Hate to admit it, but for once, the Corvids are building with style. And it's pretty effective in a dogfight as well. What the fuck is this trash? I mean, I'm going to make double the money if I get out of here. I get... Oh, God, I'm getting a laser cannon. Oh, it's one of the fucking laser fucking shotgun ones. Whatever. We'll buy a new uh, requisition mission, too. We're going to Cuatro Santos and Villa Agarda Luxury Resort. 
Let's roll. How little health do I have? <laughs> Dude, believers are fucked. Skrrr! Wait. Wait, so... What does Spacebar do? Just make me get low instead of float? Skrrr! <laughs> Whoa! Got him. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, hold up, guys. Guys, wait, hold up. He's just tearing through town going 90. Mother of God. He's got those freaking, he's got those hydraulic. He's got those hydraulics, man. Look at him go. He's got those crazy suspensions. Vroom, vroom. Wait, what's this? Debauchery. Disgusting. Skirt. This dude doesn't know what to do. Dude, I wouldn't need it. This thing's too fast. Skirt. Actual drift. What the fuck is that? Doesn't matter. Doesn't actually matter. I can't get through this. Get out of the fucking way! Fucking move! I have to use like the stompers, dude. There, Jesus. You know, people were doubting, and I know that in any second I could just explode and that could be it, but somehow. Dude, get out of the road. It's actually a car. I don't... Wait, 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 wait. Guys, look. Look. Look at this guy. I'm on... I, I can go right over them. I no longer hurt civilians. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Guys, as long as I go fast enough and constantly have overshield, it's actually kind of crazy. I have a lot of shield right now. <laughs> like, I am... I'm not pathetic. I'll tell you that. And I've got full... I've got full range of motion on the A-Grav because I can use A and D with this thing to move along my axis. In like a pretty crazy way. This vehicle is actually kind of insane. Shield chunch. I can like crunch through the fucking shield really well with the laser cannon. It doesn't do well against anything else, but against all these shielded enemies, it's really good. Guys! Just don't get hit. I'm not gonna get hit. What is this, a church? What is this, a graveyard? We gotta, we gotta reacquire all the stone that was used to make these graves. Piece of cake. Ammo. Take that. Thank you. Wait, hang on. There's like shit in the way. There we go. 
Get it out of the way. Get it out of the way. Just get it all out of the way. And uh, let's go back over here. I just want to make sure I get all the objectives done. We want that maximum payout. Just got to move quick before we lose all of our shield. Blue. Who's that? Is that guy going to tell me? Kill him? Don't take any chances right now. If it's got eyeballs, kill it. We're still missing three captains. Oh, shit. Got it. The speed, though. The fucking speed of it. Ow! Fuck, that was a bomb. Ow! -y. Ow! It's fine. Chill, 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 chill. Give me a shield. I need red ammo now. Oh, there's ammo behind that thing. Awesome. Hang on, I'm just gonna... Like, kinda... What the fuck? I don't even know where that guy came from, but it's fine. We actually benefited from that. Get rid of that shit. Easy. Alright, now we're back in business. Now we got our ammo back. We're pushing through. It's another captain. Ow! Chill! Chill! We lived. <laughs> Some people, they might find doubting to be, you know, a lucrative business. <laughs> You'd be wrong. <laughs> There's only one guy still alive in this map. There's literally no one to kill me anymore. I win. The first level. As long as I don't blow up. Just gotta slowly shoot through all this shit. You know, use all of my ammo shooting through it to get the objectives. Piece of cake. Alright, chat. We're gonna leave from the north. Come on. Man, I'm fast. Jesus. Who's this clown? Get him out of here. Cut right through the wall. Whatever. Ow! Fuck! Alright, that was a gas line. Villa Agarda Luxury Resort. Well, you know where it's not gonna have a lot of um, enemies? A luxury resort. I got a good feeling this should be relatively safe. Gotta find someone to quietly kill. That guy'll do. The second he turns around, I'm gonna chomp right through this wall. Oh shit. Die! Die! Ah! Well. You know, maybe Norman wasn't so bad. Maybe we swing back around on Norman and we'll try out like, I don't know. Swing on back around on the, on the tree house. You guys know the tree house. Do a quick tree house lap to make some quick money at Quattro Santos. Dear God, no.
Look, we're gonna do a quick in and out, one objective each zone, cash out to make some money. Okay, we just need some money. Random it coward. Well, that just gets me the normal vehicle. Well, if I wanted to play the game with a normal trash vehicle, I, that's what I'd fucking do. But I don't. I want to use the freaking treehouse with two freaking chain guns at Quattro Santos. Deploy! Guys, I'll be respectful. I'm gonna be- it's actually really hard to go back to how slow this vehicle is. It's really hard, guys. The adjustment is a little difficult. Wait, I don't want to hit the building in front of me! One of the only good buildings in this entire fucking shithole. This is one of the- oh shit. This is one of the only good buildings left! Goddamn freaking terrorists! Oh no! Whatever. Let's go. Ain't nothing, you know what, chat? That's the thing, you know? Ain't nothing quite like swinging by the old, uh, graveyard to pay your respects to beloved family and then immediately gambling at the casino and then swinging on over to uh what the live nude gun store <laughs> <laughs> hell yes let's fucking roll Live nude guns. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. Excuse me. There's just way too much trash in my fucking way is the problem with it all. And I'm running out of ammo already. Because I just can't help myself from being a little silly. Chill. Chill. Chill out. Ammo's scarce, but that's what reload, uh, that's what reloading here is for. Oh, those are real enemies. Okay, don't just shoot at them. We'll just run them over. There, got him. God, I really should have, you know, I really should have stopped at the live nude gun store, guys. I feel like I made a mistake. Are these not objectives? This is just some, it looked like, for some reason these things looked like objectives. I didn't do that. Guys, there was some kind of leak. Like, I, I'm gonna be honest. I didn't do that. There was some kind of leak. Ah. Uh, Wait, that's blue. Get that out of here. We don't need that trash. Okay, well, that's some good ammo. We'll grab that. We're gonna listen. We'll just get through this one real quick, make some money, and then buy a funny vehicle. For, or, or maybe like, we'll get some more weapons for this tank. You know, because we can all agree we like this tank. Maybe we just update our weapons. No more electricity. Everything in this place is so protected. I want, uh, yeah, I want, I want to try some. Oh, hang on, there's a uh, last ammo. 
Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Busted, guys. Uh-oh. It's time to go, guys. Time to leave. Busted. Oh, I need that ammo, though. Damn! All right, let's go. Remember, we don't have to do every objective. That's that's a choice I can make for extra cash. Get off the road. No. Trying to get better about shooting over barricades, because I can do that with this tank. If I aim far enough away, I can kind of aim right over all the bullshit. I can hit people from about a hundred million miles away if I have the ammo, which now I do not, and... I'll kill us both! <laughs> yeah, that paid off for me in a major way. We're good, guys. We're good. That, the last thing that person in that vehicle saw was Norman staring at them with the blank expression of a man who has truly nothing to lose by killing himself right now for the corporation. And that's what we like to see. We actually love to see that. We love to see that kind of, that kind of can-do attitude. Epo down. Oh, that's every captain. Oh, I'm out of ammo. You better all pray to God that you kill me before I kill you. I just overcharged my fucking engines. Smoke screen. Stuck in that corner, huh? Cowering to yourselves. Get ready for this one. Ha! Mission accomplished. Hang on. Gotta get that. We got there. Time to leave. Skirt! Two. Hey, 1.2 mil for that was is pretty good considering that was a Norman level. We'll probably go back to Ripley since we'll actually get paid. But I just wanted one. Oh my, it's three mil for these things. But I wanna. But, 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 but I want a freaking chemical projector. <laughs> Guys. I want to go to the nearest suburb on this planet and project chemicals. Campaign makes cash too. Yeah, but it's boring compared. It's boring. Wait, what does heavy mean? Why is it like flashing? Does it mean I have too much? Oh, it's the weapon type, I guess weighs a lot yeah well you know here's what we'll do we'll try out uh we'll try out this one we'll try out the buckler oh god we're gonna be using the fucking broilers two broilers i might as well kill myself uh we'll try uh, let's try the um listen we got ourselves the toro we've not done much with it we could buy the monarch this one looks like it has something new I could buy another Corvid. I could buy a Corvid mech. Primary mount, heavy. I could buy the Rat King. What is it? And what, pray tell, does a Rat King look like? You know, I thought it would look worse. Wait, this vehicle has additional auto-firing weaponry. Okay, we've got the chain guns we know how to use. Uh. Look, we'll do a random district. No, that one's too long. 
Well, well I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then we're gonna go do orientation again to make some some quick cash. I'll be right back. fucking roll. Okay, so I have a lot more weapons than what was conveyed to me on my screen. Chat. Uh, maybe I should have read more about my machine. Because I've got what says here is uh, much more than the two guns. How auto-firing are we talking? Hang on, I'm just gonna walk straight forward down the road. Enemy! Attack! Jesus Christ! Okay, that was kind of overkill. Well, come on, guys. Guys, this turret's fighting on its own! I'm not shooting anything. This is automatic. <laughs> Attention! Everyone just needs to chill out. You're startling my machine, and it is jumpy by design. I need people to relax just a little. Okay, well, I like the Corvid weapons. These are very good. Jesus. Hello. Oops. All the substations are gone, just like that. Dude, I'm barely playing the fucking game right now. The game's playing itself. Look at all this hay. I don't even know if those were combatants, but you know, I've killed non-combatants myself a couple of times, so it's fine. I'll just start joining in. This thing's fucking cracked. Die! Move out of the way! Where are you going? Wait, I might... Hang on. There we go. We are going south. You're playing some of the strongest vehicles on some of the easiest difficulty. My guy, this was the cheapest vehicle I could buy. What are you talking about? <laughs> like... Also, relax, it's a game. I'm having fun. Ah... Uh, don't need anything from that. That said, I will tell you what, we'll definitely be spending my money on buying some missions and new pilots to upgrade the modifiers more. That is, that is the intention. But I mean, I'll also tell you another thing. Uh, I did play a little bit more into the campaign on an older game save till I test it out. It wasn't much more difficult there, my guy. <laughs> Wasn't much more difficult. All right. Let's 
Stop stepping on them people there. Maybe they should get out of the way. You know? Because it is, again, I feel like the mech gets right of way. Well, everyone knows I'm here now. We got him. We got him, folks. Get chill out. Relax. Everyone, just relax. Okay. Doesn't he get more money for war crimes? Yes. In fact, I do. That And, and that is exactly why... I set my guns to shoot automatically at all movement on this level. That, thanks for reminding me to explain. The guns are set to kill everything that moves, including these guys, as you just saw. It is shooting at everyone. On sight. You see all these people? Lit up. War crimes are cringe. Well, we also do need to establish again that none of this is actually war crimes because again, this is not a war. This is eviction. Very different. These are at best, yeah, normal crime. The most you can get me for is property damage. On um, like some cars, really. Got him. That's the last captain dead. Next time, make sure to pick the right team, huh, doofus? Let's get the hell out of here. Oh shit. I lived. Uh, not sure how, but I lived. I'm gonna try to avoid stepping into anything else after that. That felt pretty bad for me. I'm just gonna kill these things as they come around the corner with my automatic guns. And then pick up their shields and then I'm fine. Piece of cake. Which ammo station? Oh, that's a that's a actually a uh, electrical grid. Now the problem is, because my shit is set to auto attack, uh, I can't kill this without walking into it, and I'm worried I might well blow up. I'd be careful. Hang on. Piece of cake. Comms tower is gone. Pick up some. No, nope, we can't get blue ammo. Well, look, we have one structure to destroy. There's only two more people left on the map. I get the weird feeling that my boatload of ammo I still have is plenty for those two. I'm gonna get that last structure and then we're out of here. And then, time up the ante. Okay, well that guy's gone. Uh, please don't blow me up. Please don't blow me up. Oh, it's gonna blow me up. Uh, oh, there's green ammo there. Never mind, guys. We're about to fix the problem. There it is, there it is. We got there. Come on, guys, let's get the hell out of here. This is all gas, isn't it? No, I'm just gonna mow this. We have had enough of being pushed around! Okay! Good news is, uh... Concerned chat members again. You likely do not have to go to work tomorrow on account of the fact that yes Your entire way of life was 
really bulldozed by this funny mech. Okay, so we have $2.9 million. That's just enough money to purchase some new stuff. Wow, some of these are pretty fucking expensive. I suggest we purchase a two, hang on. Yeah, I think we're gonna get, uh, I wanna get a, di I wanna get one that's like a decent amount of districts, but also simultaneously uh, I can leave early. Three ran random three districts, grave to the rave, long roads. Look, all of these are so appealing. We're gonna get a, uh, let's go to the, let's go to the freaking outer city. Gasworks, Turnpike, Pembroke, Outpost Site, Estrella Verde, Spaceport. Okay, sounds good. Then we have nine, uh, $900,000 left to work with. Uh, we're gonna save it. No. We're gonna do the same mech we just did because I feel like, as much as I love Treehouse, Corvid's just better for what I'm doing right now. So we're gonna roll with the Corvette again while we save up to buy some new upgrades. Very good. B. Ploy in three, two, one. Gas works turn back. We're gonna do this quick and we're gonna do it clean. I really need to start using my smoke grenades now. I feel like it's gonna matter more now. This place is crawling with enemies, but they can't see me from behind this frickin' fence. Poke my head over this. Here they fucking come. I'm gonna leave this depot alive for now. Clear it all out as best we can. Let's claim those frickin' shields. Now. Perfect. Yes, we don't care about that. Get rid of these. No, I feel like I can really go crazy out here with this, uh, with this mech. Like, I can really push. Well, with the shields I'm pulling, so let's be aggressive. Turret down, ammo trash. We're gonna reload on green and then we're moving on. Keep it just barely alive. Okay, thank you. Where's my last uh, structure? All right, let's roll. Last structures to the north. Who the hell's that doofus? I'm gonna ignore him. Mission accomplished. All that's next. All that's next is to destroy that coffee shop. Piece of cake. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Come on, chat. Even got the comms tower for good measure. Excuse me. All right. What's this? Wait. Why does this one say money? Am I gonna make more money if I do this one? Why is it? Why is it giving me an option? You can escape early. Well, I don't want to fucking do that. I ain't a pussy. Come on. I don't want to leave early because I'm fine. 
Why is my vehicle very slow? Am I slower than I... Oh, it's because I was on the train tracks. Apparently, I'm slower on that. Oh, well, there's a, v there's a uh, structure up here to get. Don't call the police. Just stay calm. Everyone chill. This is a natural phenomenon. There's nothing to be worried about. What you may think is a mech destroying your farmland is in fact just another twister. There's nothing to report. Just go back to sleep. Just go back to sleep. That's the twister warning alarm. All there is to do right now is relax. Die. 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 My ammo! Oh well, I'll have to use my automatic ammo. Until I find the depot. Damn, this twister has some gigantic feet. Guys, rude. Why is that, why was I just being, what was that guy running at me for? Hello? Why'd that guy lunge at me? What was his game plan? Oh shit. Hey, what are you- Hey! That guy called the police. That's it. Now I'm pissed. That's it. Now I'm mad. I'm gonna take it out on everyone's Wi-Fi. Check your phones. Check them now. Uh, this would blow me up if I got hit by it, but I do have overshield. Ow. It's worth it for that depot XP. I want that money. All right, let's roll. I think the depot up here is gonna be the one for green ammo, which I need. We'll load up on that and then we'll be good to go. I have to kill two captains. Oh shit. For them. Oh shit for them. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's called automatic weaponry. Man. Hang on. Yeah. Keyboard cord is in my way. Perfect. Green ammo. My stream went down to 140p and that's where it'll stay. All right. Until you provide legal documentation showing why you're squatting on this corporate planet. And that's where it's gonna be until you explain why you're here. I was born here, what the fuck? Born a disgusting squatter. Enjoy not having gas for your freaking car. Yeah, call the alarm again, dude. Yeah, you already told on me. Pathetic. Mission accomplished. That's the last survivor of their people. Perfect mission. Let's get the hell out of here. Come on. Victory honk.
These squatter would be safer if they didn't have giant ammo depots. Yeah, I just wasted all my ammo and you could just climb up the mech and just grab me and throw me out. I'm not like powerful on the inside. Oh yeah, piece of cake. Deploy, engage. Last zone and up front, they're giving me exactly what I need to reload my heavy cannons. Thank you. Just destroying that gas because I don't like it. Wow, chat. Is that your house? Be honest. Is it? Come on. That's a lot of enemies. Probably want to be careful with this. Smoke screen down! Give me some cover. When they come through this, we light them up with the automatic cannons. Reloading! Alright, piece of cake. When they get close enough, we just stomp them, re replenish our shields. I think, well, I take less damage if I'm facing my opponent, right? If I'm facing with my arrow towards them, I take less damage from their shots. So I think I want to make sure I'm doing that. Okay, well, that's the entire garrison. <laughs> that's everyone. The entire map came to kill me, and they fucking lost. Oh, wait, there's more. Never mind, went up to 68. I don't know why I thought it was 48. Did it say 48 before? Or did I just go cross-eyed? Oh, well. The rest will die, too. Oh, they'll all die. Don't attack the depot. I need that. Okay, thank you. Let's roll. 65 out of 68. Are there any, anyone still alive? Hello? Where is the last survivor? There they are. 66 out of 68. Where are the survivors? I will not be allowing any survivors today, guys. So, like, listen, if you're squatting on the planet, let's just say, like, let's shrug and say you had a good run. But please come out. Just come out. Like, you had a good run. It was epic. High fives all around. But you gotta go. You don't even have gas or Wi-Fi anymore. I'm not sure exactly what the plan is. Well, that is everyone. Nope, there's still a captain. Now that's everyone. It's over. The comm tower over here. Which I'll quickly just ping two shots at. And then there's a substation up north. I'll grab that too. And then we'll have 100% of this place. And then we're out of here. Piece of cake. Easy mission. Boom. Let's go. All that's left are these random stragglers. I'm not walking around, all right? I'll tell you that. Just cutting my way through. 4.6 million dollars. 
in the bag. Guys, that's all. Guys, <laughs> we're, we're already so close to being able to afford Mother's Love, the uh, apocalypse tank. We're already so close. Is that a... Hey, I'm like squinting at this vehicle. Is that a freaking tuk-tuk? For 20 million dollars? Get that. I can't afford it. We could get the party, man! We could afford the party, man! But guys, I think the best investment I could do right now is buying another operation and simply switching to my tall treehouse vehicle and buying a new weapon. Because you guys, here's the thing. I'd really like, I'd really like to chemical project. You know what I mean? Is that a siege howitzer? Is that, is that a siege howitzer? 305 millimeter FAE cluster or chemicals. Let's get the chemical projector. You guys know what I mean? Let's buy chemical projector. We'll install that there. And in the other one, we'll keep the uh, chain gun that we love so much. All right. And then we still have 2.5 mil, which we'll spend on getting a why don't I just... I mean, I could save it. I bought... No, I'd like to buy another mission. Uh, let's do... Let's do just a random three districts, no exit unlock, so that we'll always have it for later. Or I invest in a... No, we don't have anyone that we can afford that's better. Yeah, I think we roll with what we've got here. Could save up for EMP grenade, active camouflage, A active camo. That's pretty cool. Okay, tomato, please win. I put up my house for. M I put up. I put my house up for mortgage. Oh, don't worry, man. We're gonna win it. I'm gonna take us straight to the Southern Reach. Yep. We are going to the Southern Reach using chemical warfare. We have $48,000 left to our name. Deploy. So, uh, how does chemical warfare work? Let's just find, like, the nearest guy walking around. That guy looks good. Yikes. Anyone hear that? No one's coming. Hang on, can I hit that from here? The Ark says yes. Dude, this is sick! I don't need any of these. Chemical clears the way for the rest. Oh, hey. Just clear it all out. Just clear it all out. Get the fuck away from me. All right. Grab it. I'm gonna try to save the chem- I mean, we have a lot of this, actually. Hang on, we have a boatload of chemicals. It's got a really long cooldown, is the thing with it. I think those guys were attacking. Dude, it just melts stuff. That's rad. I love this thing. I love using chemicals to clear out these squatters. I just wish I could aim the other gun. I 
I just wish I didn't have to rely on it so much because I can't aim anything else. Eh. At least the chemicals can't hurt me. I can kind of just, I can kind of just do whatever the fuck I want. Captain. I have to melt through this wall to hit them. Oh, we got them. Fucking hell, man. Jesus. All right, we're good. First level done. Let's get the hell out of here. Come on. Look, these people had it coming. Not one of them, Chad, not one of the people living here said happy birthday to me when my birthday came around. You think I'm just, what, you think I'm just gonna forget that? That guy walked into the, those guys walked into the gas. They walked into the exploding gas themselves. Yeah, all that gas does is it makes you explode. That's all the gas does. It has no, like, there's no, like, window of time where you can undo it. If you touch the gas, you explode. That's the poison part. Some lovely estates here. Jobs are simple. Let's just quietly roll. Actually, we can just get this right now. Yeah. Cut a little hole for it and then just let the gas do its thing. Jesus! I didn't do that. Guys, I, I didn't do that part. That part was, uh... That part was like faulty wiring. I swear to God. There's some suspicious wiring going on in this place. Uh, this is a nice area. This is like this is like premium real estate, guys. We got the suburbs. Yeah. Yes. Just firing a warning shot in to see if uh, there's anyone in there. I'm not seeing any ammo store. We love that. Nice walls, nice, nice hedges, really held up. My house! Jail, guys, your house, you have insurance, right? Why would you not have house insurance on these kinds of homes? It's like throwing money away. Get through all this. Oh, green ammo, I need that. Hang on. I had to reverse over that mech there. Is the front of my car just tires for like a bumper? It looks like yes. I didn't notice that till now. It's got tires. Not bad. It gets the job done. All right, let's roll. Thank you. I really do like the gas. I feel like I should have doubled up on gas. You know what I mean? Like, I don't even think I needed this chain gun. I should have had the confidence in gas build to simply use gas the entire time. I think that's my biggest uh, takeaway from this is I should have just doubled down on gas. Are we sure this Lord guy was the villain of this world? You mean the uh, great leader? Oh yeah, he was evil, guys. He, the, the company called him and asked him to pay taxes for living here and he said no. All right, can you imagine? Th think about it. Think about it genuinely. Try putting yourself in the company's shoes hearing something like that. I just can't believe it. Oh shit. Yep. We actually do, uh, we are expected to follow road rules. We are supposed to follow the streets if we see a street. Is it? 
Oh, hang on. Uh, if I get a little bit closer to this wall, I might just be able to peek right over. And... Okay, we got him. Someone's alive in there, I think. No, we got him. Oh, I was dying from that. I do melt in my own gas. Guys, I breathe the same air as these people. Can you believe that? I didn't know that was true till now. I really gotta stop driving through the gas. I was just trying to get the shield balls. He bleeds. Guys, do not push me. I swear to God, I'll turn the music off and start honking. Do not, do not like declare any kind of weakness of mine. I will turn the music down. I will just start honking and that's it. You understand? Well. Get rid of that. Reload. Reload the gas. Perfect. Get rid of the gas. Oh, we're done here. Let's get the fuck out of here. Fill up my shield and let's go. I will I will turn this honking into the next freaking penis music. I see that in chat. I see you guys asking for penis music. You'll never get it again. You keep on pointing out my weaknesses. I'll just play this. I would be shitting myself if I heard all that and then I saw this shit fucking rolling over a hill towards me. That'd be it. Piece of cake. Exeter station is next. Roll, it's just trained. Clear it fast, clear it clean. I mean, I'll say one thing about the gas, though. It's kind of hard to aim. Does good damage, though. Does good. Does good work, though. So you run out of ammo with your main gun and all of a sudden you're just shooting this gas on its own. Thank God I've got a million shield. Give me that. Reload. Back in business. That guy was trying to call the alarm on me. Gas is a noob trap. Doesn't feel like it. Feels okay. Feels, uh... Feels effective enough. Like it's working, it's doing its job. It's melt it's melting turrets down. It's getting the job done. I'm very alive. Oh shit. I mean I am running out of ammo, something fierce. Hang on, I just have to run over vehicles again. That's how we have to do it. The old-fashioned way. Come here. No, come here. There it is. Ammo. I need it. Did it melt the ammo? Does it? Does it actually? Does the gas melt the ammo? Because if if true, that's funny. I'm. It's that toxic. Huh? I am melting down my own ammo drops. Yikes. Well. That's most of the garrison dead. I've run them all over. Come on. Come on, push through it. There's my target. Well, Captain dead from long range, dude. Jesus. Mm. 
Uh, last captain should be like over this hill. Just need eyes on him and I'll take him down. Hang on. Get around this. Bam. He's Dunzo. Or at least that's what I had hoped would happen. No! All right, we're good. Guys, it's all right. At the end of the day, all I really need this tank to do is run shit over. I don't need ammo. All I have to do is that. Problems solve themselves. All I gotta do is kind of roll into it. Just a little, just kind of like give him a little tap. That's it. If I can find the green ammo depot, that would be pretty good. I would really enjoy that. Most of my shield, dude. I'm fucked. Come on. There it is. Green ammo. We're all right. We're okay, guys. That was. It was worth it. It was all worth it. I'm back in business. Here we go. There's way too many cars parked in this fucking area. I'm gonna fill up on ammo and then we move on. Still think gas build was skibbity get rizzing? Can you listen here, man? What if your fucking like family saw you typing like that? What if? What would they think? What would what would they think? That made me sick. Oh, that's not even a freaking depot for ammo. It's a freaking con. I need to learn all the icons, man. Just a worthless comm station. You know, I'm gonna be honest, Chad. I also kind of miss my rail gun. Remember the rail gun? Whatever. I uh, will swing over to this. I'll grab whatever ammo there is. I do miss the rail gun. I think the rail gun. That was something else. If I could get a rail gun on that fast car. Ooh. Then we'd be cooking. At least I get paid for these detours with like minor income. Well, there's my gas reloaded too. Okay, bye guys. Get the hell out of here. All right, two more levels. Calvo Farm Outpost. We're gonna do this one quick in and out. This is not a, this is not a farm area whatever what, what do I know the farm has seen better days it's more of a casino area now all of the structures are straight down oh perfect we got angles on all of it Get the gas back down. Next one, gassed. Gas it again. All right, next one, gas it. Majority of structures have been dispatched moving forward. Eyes on last gas target. Accidentally gassed myself. We'll report back. Soon. Keeping spirits high. 
But I am being shot. Gasp myself again. I need the shield from this. Report! This guy's too short for me to kill! The worst has happened. They've made their vehicles short enough to dodge me, guys. It's okay, we got him. They figured out short tech. Freaking farmer uprising, man. Jesus. All right, job's done. I'm grabbing my ammo. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Stop following me. I need a better secondary, man. This sucks. I'm out of here. You'll never make this pay taxes. I just got charged at by a bunch of tractors. They barely even did damage to me. I just got charged at by tractors. I'm out of here. But first. Society will thank me later. No more gambling. Ever. Last ride. This place is really green. Guess it. Shell it. Whoa, 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 whoa! It's the whole army! Oh, shit! That was actually a lot of guys. That was that wasn't looking good. Some of them are still just short enough that I can't hit them. Can I just like run them down? All right, Sim Four neighborhood. Yeah, this would be a lot. This would be a pretty fresh freaking take on the Sims, though. You know what I mean? Zomboid ass map. What the? That guy ran into me. I didn't even hurt him. He just killed himself. Uh, got no eyes on any of my objectives. Oh, there we go. We got him. Don't call the fucking police. Everyone just relax. Just gotta kill one more captain and I'm out of here. Was that my last normal shell? Damn it! I keep melting all my ammo. I just have to... If I can get eyes on this captain, we're fine. Looks like they might be camping out by this... Like... Condominium place. Hang on. I got eyes. Just shell him from here. We got him. Let's get the fuck out of this place and cash out. Come on. Doubters once again reeling from loss. They have no idea how they may even recover from this. Maybe they won't. Six point nine million dollars. Six point nine million dollars. Not bad. That gives me enough money to be able to afford a funny vehicle. Is this one just called Coffin? Hmm. So it seems like, wait, these, so these ones are redacted. If we buy one of these, we don't get to know what it is until we've purchased it. Like we don't, we don't get a, 
We don't get any kind of like input till we've bought it. I mean, I've been I've been dialing in on these Corvid ones, but maybe there's one from another that's better for me. No. No. You just get stats. Yeah. Let's see here. So, Rat King was heavy, heavy. Heavy auxiliary. What's the difference between main and heavy? What about brand loyalty? But, streamer. What about brand loyalty? You're right. I should stick with what I have right now, chat, which is, uh... The Rat King, an incredibly heavy, wait a minute. Tank, so Treehouse is heavy, heavy, but really slow. What else do I have that's, but what's, we don't have any turret type yet. We don't have a turret in our thing. What about A-Grav, Corvid? Is there any A-Grav heavies? There's the long board, which looks like a fucking piece of shit. Oh, I'm looking at Spacer. You're right. Short bus. There's also the Roper. This is only one mil. How about we get this piece of shit looking thing? And then we're gonna grab a cluster harvester on one arm. And with the other one, we'll invest in, uh, you know, uh, laser focusing, um, a Tomo with the rest of my money. This thing might be straight up an affront to God, but hey, I think this is, I think this is gonna be really good, guys. We're gonna random district it. Let's see, let's, maybe this will be great. He's so broke, but I'm gonna make my, what the fuck is this? Okay, well, that's a big arch. Uh, it looks like I gain more distance when I'm moving with it. Let's just target this lovely, like, I don't know. Uh, there's some guys over there. At that extremely well-guarded mini-mart. <laughs> Let's uh, do with that. Jesus Christ! Oh shit! Fucking hell! Do not go to the mini mart today. I'm dead. <laughs> Do not go to mini mart today. Well, uh, you can't win them all, chat. <laughs> I'm just gonna restart. <laughs> How did I take that much? Did I, did I, was it because I, hang on. Guys, check this one out. Hey guys, look, I'm gonna catch it in my mouth. <laughs> Restart. Okay guys, so I just have to be really careful. Now let me test out the other gun quick. That's a nice lawnmower. So I've got, I've got a close range long lawnmower and a long range lawnmower. I just can't get caught out getting blasted by this thing. But my God, is that thing very good at clearing. But if anything gets close to me, I got to hit him with the beam. No choice otherwise. 
Wait, is there? Hang on. I need to test something that's going to be very important for my survival. Say I'm aiming at something over there. Technically, this tower is in the way. Okay, it won't hit it. Or, or will it? It doesn't. Okay, good. It needed to check that quick. Okay, this uh, this this build is actually kind of cracked. Hang on, I I actually really like this. Get rid of that. We don't need it. Uh, get get rid of this. We don't need it either. Goodbye. Okay, cool. Get rid of this guy. We don't we don't we don't we don't need him. We keep moving. HOA upgraded the landscaping service. This, this clogged up highway. Get rid of it. All these cars are trash. Oh fuck, I missed and hit the entire infrastructure of the train system, but it's fine. We also didn't need that. That was actually, in fact, another thing we were getting rid of. Dude D calling. Guys, it's fine. Trash. Wait, I need that. No! We'll get him next time, guys. So hard to differentiate from what I need and what I want, you know? Don't need. Need. Dude, what chance do you fucking idiots think you have? Pathetic. Die, freak. Almost missed. Almost missed. Ha oh shit, he's gonna... Chill, 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 chill. He's lunging. We got him. All right, guys, let's get the fuck out of here. Ow. I didn't realize that was going to be bombs. And how, pray tell, did I miss that shit? That one's got him. Now we got him. It's hard to aim this. It's, uh, guys, this is actually like a really tricky, like, uh, weapon to aim. You know, that's, you know, it's hard to hit. It's hard to hit with these AA guns and cluster bombs. It's not easy. A lot of people get up in arms that there's a lot of collateral coming from using this thing. But, like, it's hard to aim. I'm sorry that most of the... Oh, shit, hang on. I have to... Good news is they've actually got a public, uh, publicly available wholesaler for uh, howitzer ammo. I can actually just reload it right here. Thank you. Get up! Man, shit. <laughs> Man, shit. All right, chat. Well, listen, I just wanted to check this out because it's a pretty fun little game. We're doing a little bit of a shorter thing today because um, I will be streaming all week. Uh, and I'm still kind of... Look, the side effect of the whole procedure yesterday is that my tummy still feels... Uh, honestly, it still feels pretty bad. Uh, I'm like... I'm like getting food in me again, eating and stuff. I'm not feeling like a hundred percent yet. I'll probably feel a lot better tomorrow, but uh, yeah, we'll be doing like a full normal old stream tomorrow and I'll see you all then. So thanks for coming on by and hanging out uh, tomorrow. I, I, I'm not a hundred percent sure what I'm going to be doing, but uh, hopefully Thursday will be hell divers with uh, the lads. So keep your eyes peeled for that. We'll be doing the sequel. Helldivers 2 comes out on Thursday. We'll be checking that one out. All right. I'll see you all then. Thanks for coming on by. Appreciate it. See y'all later. Bye, dude.